What up, what up, what up, everybody? What's going on? Welcome to my channel, T Girl Magic Tarot. Yeah, yeah. Here to do another reading for my lovely Gemini and Collective. Okay, babies, I hope everyone's doing well. Thank you, thank you. Um, Sending everybody lots of love and healing energy. Keep in mind now it's a general message, so it's not going to resonate with everybody, somebody, nobody, and we don't know. Okay, so I don't know your situation. Just reading the energy, so only take what fits for you and your situation and the the rest, okay? Um, thank you guys for all your love, your support, your likes, your shares, your subscribes, your donations, all the love that you give me and yourselves in this channel. I just truly appreciate each and every one of you. Um, yeah, let's get right into it, but I feel like someone woke up on the wrong side of the bed or... I don't know, but watch out for evil eyes. These are just general downloads. Look, some of y'all better watch some, you know, just be careful. People are not in a good mood for whatever reasons. They're just sad and mad and they, I don't know, baby. But there is somebody that's imprisoned in their head, entrapped or something. That's what I was getting. Yeah, look, see, entrapped in their head and that's the truth or maybe about a, some type of truth that was spoken or said or you figured out some type of truth and now this person is scared or somebody is scared in your energy. I don't know not funny about some type of unaliving plot that's one of the things that i did get okay yeah because when i picked up this card so it was so they were planning to unalive someone but that's in a reverse okay so some maybe you got clarity about an ex or somebody that i don't know okay maybe a, this could be for some a criminal possibly that's scared that somebody's on your ass because the detectives or the police done figured out that you you about to go to jail or something like that because somebody then told on your ass and offered up some type of information okay about a uh, gemini or the magician okay so you feel manipulated or, or whatever you could be this magician though okay thinking you slick or some type of manipulation now somebody's scared because of secrets about maybe coming to someone's house to uh, unalive them that's what i'm getting yeah they were the, the, somebody was paid to do so but mm, from a king of pentacles or a king of pentacles hired somebody to come or a gemini and a king of pentacles or an air sign and an earth sign child look this is too much but somebody is scared now because somebody told on them that they were getting uh, about a murder plot or an unaliving plot to come to someone's house at night possibly and that shit got exposed, okay? I was trying to get new love, but honey, oh my gosh. And that's the truth. They was about to unalive your ass, cuz. Oh my God. And they was trying to figure out how to move things to calmer water. They're trying to sign in. They, they were trying to plot, plan, and strategize with the Six of Swords. Scientifically, they were trying to... I'm getting forensics. So, I don't know, uh, child... And a queen of wands of some magic or mm, mm, queen king of cups and then the strength so yeah that's what i'm getting i'm getting that there is either a father figure a baby daddy a pisces cancer or a scorpio who's scared right now because i'm getting you gemini you're showing up as the queen of wands energy for whoever the high vibrational energy is it doesn't matter for gemini but i read for high vibe gemini's and all the zodiac signs that are in the high vibration and so for you showing up as the queen of wands, you're very vibrant, sexy, abundant. I feel like some energies got blocked as well, but I want to stick to this plot, okay, with this magician. Now, this could be you, Gemini. Now, this ain't a high vibe Gemini, okay? But whoever this queen of wands is, is very strong, and it's an epic fail. So that's the thing. They have some type of um, back how child they got a contract in the ethers whoever they this person is whoever this queen of wands is or they know magic or they know ties with him downstairs but they don't worship him downstairs does that make sense it's like i'm getting high priestess energy where both alliances like they they you know they're tapped in with god the most high in the right side but also they have that respect because their ranking is higher then the devil has to respect whoever this queen of wands is bam okay and um, so now either a magician, a king of cups who has Pisces, Cancers, and Scorpio, they done did some magic or they drove to your house and did something to your home at night, but your home was protected. That's what I'm getting. Okay, yeah. 
whoever, yeah, you got the Ten of Cups in your home or whatever they did. Yeah, they tried to cause some type of illusion, some conflict magic, and they did this at night, okay? They did that at night, this murder plot, or I'm sorry, unaliving plot, because you can't say. It's just hard to talk nowadays, because everything is so censored and monitored, and everybody's unhealed, okay, all triggered by the speech, like, golly, but anyway, it's neither here nor there. So let's get right into it about this, this unaliving plot, you guys, okay, because I'm going to leave this card out here, it's an unaliving plot. Okay, and maybe somebody lied on you or tried to set you up in a murder plot to say, you know, and then the police knew that something was fishy, but it's not in the ocean. Okay, that's what I'm getting. So someone lied on you or someone's scared because they decided, they, I don't know. Spirit, tell me about this um, unaliving plot, please. How someone was paid, a baby daddy, an ex-lover. Yeah, they got caught up under judgment and also high priestess. So I'm getting two storylines. I'm, or, or it's probably one. So these people were doing magic behind the scenes as well to set up this this unaliving plot to get away with it. But they got caught up, okay? Because remember, the energy that you give out is the same energy that you get back and with a love situation. So this is an ex-lover, baby daddy, baby mama energy who does occultic things, occult, occult, O-C-C-U-L-T, <laughs> Or you're the high, oh, you're the high priestess too, because I said I was getting high priest energy, Gemini, you're the lovers, and this person's under judgment, this ex-lover, they lied on you for some reason, ooh, they lied to you on the, for the hitman, this, what did they lie about, spirit, they were manipulative, king of swords energy showing up, they lied on you, Gemini, you didn't showed up and showed out, could be a Libra involved, okay, doesn't have to be, or Aquarius, but someone communicated to this hitman, King of Swords, or the police authority figure, you know, they lied on you, or they realized that they lied on you, and now this person's in regret, because now maybe, why are they in regret, spirit? Because now the hitman wants to offer, oh my God, the hitman wants to offer you an ace of pentacles, so the hitman done fell in love with you, that's what I'm getting with this lover's energy as well. So the, the hitman feels manipulated, okay, by the information that they t were told on this high priestess and now this magician is sorry that they lied on you for some reason because they hired or paid somebody to unalive you and they paid them a lot of money, okay? But now this king of swords energy or this hitman energy wants to move, oh no, honey, wait. They want to take passion. So whoever the hitman is, I didn't know it was going to turn out like this, but whoever the hitman is, they are passionate about you. I guess they've been, I don't see any of the Page of Swords, which is like a spy or studying card, but I feel like whoever this hitman is, I don't know who is who right now. It could be anybody. They could all be the same sign or have that different aspects in their chart. But this person wants to take action towards you. They're trying to strategize because you make this person happy. They see you're the sun or you're the truth or this person sees who you are, whoever the hitman was. So the hitman didn't fucked around and fell in love with Gemini, okay? And now they're pissed off or something like that or they're mad at this king of swords, Gemini, magician. It could be a Leo. This Gemini could have Leo in their chart, whoever this person, the hitman is. They want to give you some type of justice, okay? This 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 whoever the hitman is they want to take action or whoever the person that was getting ready to take action so they're trying to plot plan and strategize how they're going to come to you and make this love offer this is a chameleon so this person possibly has been i don't know they have to be been following you for them to be hired and paid let me get a little bit more spare. what is going on so mm -hmm. they told me somebody tried there's no, so this person, I don't know. Well, the reason that they hired a hitman is because you possibly left this baby daddy or baby mama and there is no second chances by Felicia, okay? And whoever the your ex-lover is, I guess that they're embarrassed or something or now they, they got caught or the information has been exposed, they're embarrassed. And they're in the nine of swords. They're stressed out. They're worried. They're anxious because they're facing some type of jail time right now. Because 
they couldn't let you go. And then for some of them, it's magic. Okay, they hired a spiritual hitman, but the spiritual hitman got a taste of your energy and then fell in love with you. Okay? And you're the Ten of Cups to this hitman energy. Okay? They were put under some type of illusion, some type of lie. Okay, the cause, I don't know. But yeah, they were spying on you. This hitman was spying on you with the Prince of Swords energy. Okay? Um, and they saw how you moved, and it was pleasurable how you moved. They loved the way you moved. So they see, I mean, they're really pissed off about at your ex-lover. This could be, I don't know. The hitman could be a king of swords energy. Excuse me. The baby daddy could be this king of pentacles energy. The hitman could also be the king of wands, king of swords energy. It could be a, uh, I'm, I'm getting air sign energy, fire sign um, and earth sign energy, but somebody got called judgment or they're under judgment or under something. Yeah. So this King of Wands energy, the hitman energy wants to give you the wheel of fortune. So this is, could be like a, uh, I don't want to say mafia type energy. That's what I'm getting. And he see you, he's a wealthy man. Now you can have the 10 of pentacles with this person. This person want to give you the 10 of pentacles. I don't know how this is coming out. Yes, this person wants to dominion over you. He wants to take care of you, put you in some type of protection. Yes, from this magician. So the magician is the hitman. or The, the magician is the hitman. So this magician, King of Wands energy, wants to give you some type of justice. They want to reveal to you possibly about another hitman or your baby daddy or baby mama who, you know, wanted to keep you in the Nine of Swords or was cruel to you or child kept you. so they stressed out about whoever i don't know they trying to confuse me whoever this king of swords whoever the hitman is they're stressed out that's why they're because they don't know how they're going to come to you and tell you the story or this information because you're possibly going to be guarded yeah they want victory and success they want forward movement they see you as being victorious and successful and they done fell in love with you just like i said so i don't know babies i am just kind of shocked like, wow, this is deep. Yeah, so what's going on, Spirit, with this King of Swords energy, this Hitman energy? Tell me about this baby daddy. Who's under judgment? So either, because I do feel the police got involved. Somebody paid or was paid, I don't know, to tell? On, I don't know. Hold on. Yeah, that's what brought down the tower. But anyway, tell me more, because this, um, this King of Cups, Hitman energy wants to come out and tell you that he wants to give or she wants to get but i'm getting a masculine energy talking to a feminine energy they want to get the ball turning in their favor okay the wheel going in their their favor they see you as their endless love they, they there was an unaliving plot against you okay but this person whoever this person is maybe they're friends or something like this because i see two men up actually three men it could be three people working up against you this magician ex-lover I'm getting it's air sign too. And then it's also a plot against another air sign. So here we go with air sign on air sign crime again. And an ex-lover lied on you to these two people to try to unalive you. They were paid by this magician or this king of swords or this king of wands, baby daddy, king of pentacles energy. But the king of pentacles, these hitman or this hitman then sat back and watched how you move and ooh, you are the sun. So now you're the sun. You're this person's happiness or they see clearly that this person done lied or something like that and how you can never hurt i heard you can never hurt a gnat oh wow okay yeah and this person wants to marry you okay but they scared they're scared but this is the hitman that's scared what are they scared of spirit making an offer and you're not accepting the offer because they don't think that you're going to think this offer is real because of what is transpiring for a lot of you well not for a lot of you for some of you and they're afraid that you're going to lay this shit to rest. And they're going to be sick if you deny this person. Oh, my God. So this is crazy. And, honey, they going to fight. Look. Look. I don't know. What's the five of wands of spirit? Because I'm feeling like they don't want you to say no or they're going to they're gonna go crazy. Oh, my God. Spirit, what's the five of wands? And they're going to want to know why you're such a Karen. Or they're going to think you're a Karen. I don't know. They Look, they really are very hot and passionate towards you. He's showing up as the king of wands. This must be a, some type of emperor, boss daddy, CEO. I did say, you know, mafia mob type of energy. 
Okay, they're getting ready to want to figure, or he's trying to figure out how to communicate to you. Okay, because they want to win at all costs. That's what I'm getting. Also, somebody then threw some magic. Some of these men got together and did some magic. Okay, so they possibly wouldn't get caught. But somebody was smarter than the average bear to say, let me sit back and watch this person for a little while. And as they sat back and watched you, they told this king of swords, mm, something's fishy and it's not in the ocean because whoever I'm seeing and looking at right now, I want to give them the ace of pentacles and the four of pentacles because I have the hots for them and I think that they the one and I can build and grow with this person. So now this person is like feeling defeated. Whoever this, whoever, whoever paid the people to do something to you, now they feel defeated and they feel left out in the cold now, okay? Yes, because whatever you... You're in. You're still in this energy. And that's probably where they were. Why did this? Why does this lover do this spirit? Why is this lover trying to hire these hitmen um, on high vibe, high vibe, and high vibe Gemini? Oh, that's a lot. Because you took a feat. You took okay. Because you ghosted this person. You took a leap of faith. You decided to focus on yourself. Focus on your money. You got more spiritual, in line with God. You, you went within, okay, you saw something about whoever the person you were with that made you ghost them, or you thought you saw they were foolish or a risk taker, you thought they were unruly, and you decided to just focus on your money, so because you decided to focus on yourself and your self-love and your finances, um, you're the nine of pentacles, this person ain't, was angry because you decided to take a leap of faith and ghost this person to become the Ten of Pentacles. And like I said, and work on yourself with this Eight of Pentacles. So they decided to go to, yeah, and whatever. So, and you took off, or whatever you did, or you have structure and discipline, or you disciplined your life, or you move forward with your life, and you became this Nine of Pentacles with a new beginning and with a solid foundation. Now... That's why this lover did what they did because they are like, I don't know, they were stressed out or they felt betrayed in some type of way. Yes, this lover, or they thought that you had another lover that you wanted to go to and was holding yourself back from them because they couldn't believe that they was full of shit and you just wanted to be by yourself. Yeah, they just t they couldn't take accountability and responsibilities for why you wanted to leave the situation. So they got angry and they started doing shit in secret and making these fish ass false ass offers to hold on to you so this person feels even if they unalive you that they still that would be their way to hold on to you or either call and then also also to cause conflict and chaos in your life to keep you stuck okay and they hope that you wouldn't see it or they were trying to set it up so you wouldn't know who it was but you're the star though you know everything okay you know these people were trying you know whoever this energy is was trying to unalive you clearly they're cray cray and they're unbalanced, okay? And they see you as everything. Like you can replenish, you can replenish their, I don't know, stability. I've heard that, the stability. And that's why, and then when you rejected them, what happened with, so that's when they got mad because they look like, they, they're, they're worried about money and stability. Damn. Okay, spirit, anything else? So how, what's the obstacle? What was the obstacle? The obstacle is this person done fell in, this king of pentacles is the obstacle. So it could be this, this mob guy, emperor energy, okay? The obstacle is because he was looking and when he saw, he was like, hell no, I'm not about to do that to this earth angel because I love them. Child, what happened? Ooh, yes. And when he said, I love them, that made whoever he paid, who paid them or hired them to feel left out in the cold and they got worried. They started to worry. Yeah, because the, the plans have been changed. Okay, mm, abort mission, abort mission. So tell me more about this boss daddy CEO energy. Oh, he's the emperor in the reverse, honey. So this is an over controlling, manipulative energy, low key, high key. Well, for him to be hired and take the money to do what, but I mean, I guess, you know, God works in mysterious ways. God won't touch the the, 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 the unalivers, you know, person that's plotting to unalive you. He will touch their heart and change their mind. And make them fall in love. That's what earth angels do. Yes. And he was like, he was. He don't want to lay this down to rest. He changed his mind with the judgment in reverse. Definitely. So he changed his mind on you guys. And that was because of who you are. Because of your love and your light. And now this emperor is worried. Or this magician is worried. Or somebody is worried, honey. 
and somebody's ashamed of this plot. So this man is ashamed of himself. He's in sorrow because he done accepted the bribe or accepted the money, but then after he saw what he saw, he decided to go down another path. So what's gonna happen is, how is this man gonna come towards Gemini High Vibe? If, if, how are they, wait, how are they coming? They are gonna come and give you some information, okay? And they're gonna take, child, I don't know if this information is gonna make you happy. Child, how is, mm, cause this person wants dominion over you or he wants to come down your path. So this person is gonna come travel towards you and speak some type of truth to you because the Prince of Swords is some type of truth and communication. And they're gonna tell you that I love you, I want you, and it might make you happy. This is this because I asked what's going to happen the six of cups. So this is they're going to tell you somebody from your, they're going to tell you about your past love. That's what they're going to do. But it's going to be. I don't know if you know of this person from your past or they're going to tell you about somebody from your past. But whatever this information is or how they're going to tell you and come up, it's going to give you some type of I'm confused, pleasure in the wheel of fortune. Spirit, what is this uh, six of cups energy? What's this? Okay, so they're going to come tell you about somebody who was heavily burdened to you in your life. They're going to tell you about the plot of whoever this magician, high priestess. This magician could be the high priestess. They're under judgment right now. Okay, and the will is getting ready to turn in your favor because you have someone that wants to take action to you. Tell me about the energy of this king of wands. Is he good or bad? Like a spirit? Because I'm getting mixed energy. Are they they're good and bad? Princess of Pentacles. They look at you like a princess or a prince. I'm getting a masculine energy. It doesn't matter, like, seriously. So this person's looking at you like a princess. Like, they want to pamper you. You're the princess, the sun, the happiness. They want to protect you. They want to fight for you. Yes. And they want, and they, look, they feel embarrassed and foolish because they look at you, love. They see you as this ace of cups. They want to have a baby with you. Lord have mercy. But they all in their head about it because whatever they were going to do was so cruel. It was in, inhumane. At, okay? Yeah. To this Queen of Swords energy. So, Jim, and I, how is, so tell me more about the, uh, how is the personality of this person? Spirit, what's going on? Oh, my God. They're your wish fulfillment, child. They really are. They are your wish fulfillment. And they're stuck right now because... They don't know how, they, they yeah, they're, the spirit, tell me more. How are they stuck? Are they stuck or not? Nah? I think this person pleasures himself to you as well. To be honest with you, yes, they do. So this is a king, they do magic too. So I don't know if they were doing sex magic in the beginning. I don't know how this is working out, child. I don't want to tap into that part. But this person thinks that it could be successful with you. They see you as single and abundant. I don't know if this other energy lied on you and said you was in the five of pentacles, broke like a joke or something like that, or you were needy, or whatever the case may be. What was the lie, spirit? What was the lie? Oh, dang. Hold on. That's... It's your past that lied on you. So they said that you were sneaky, you were imbalanced, you were broke, you were crazy. You know, um, you changed on them, or you took a change for the worst, and you're really, I don't know, they lied on you. What did they lie on, Spirit? Let me see. And they, they're, they're in regret that they lied on you, too. So what did they lie on, Spirit? Want to be right this. What did they lie on, Gemini, High Life, Cross Watcher about? What did they lie on the babies about? The mask caught off. You caught me. They lied. I am bisexual, and I don't know how to tell you. So whoever your baby daddy is or this ex-lover, they're bisexual. They don't know how to tell you. I don't know if this is one of their ex-lovers that they hired, but whoever the ex-lover is, I mean, not the ex-lover, whoever the hitman is, they're in love with your ass, okay? But I still want to know what that lie was, Spirit. We can't brush about that lie. and so, I don't know. You took somebody's balls. You took somebody's power. Okay, so you, you took your power back, and now whoever you took your power back from, they're saying, where's my balls? Okay, exactly. Um, This person, maybe they looked you up to see that you didn't have a criminal record. Oh, they were trying to set you up. 
lying on you about a criminal history and maybe when they did an investigation for some of y'all it is a police officer a crooked cop who started investigating you looking you up and things like that doing dirty cop job and then found out that you was actually the good guy okay and then they changed their mind you don't have a criminal history whoever you are they lied on you and said that you I don't know. They try to get you caught up or something to take the bait in something, baby. I don't. I don't know. There's so many of you. I, I couldn't even begin. But they got defeated. The five of swords because this person was trying to win at all costs. Or maybe this person. I don't know. All I know is there's no second chances, and this person has an STD. And I don't, that came out of nowhere. Okay, out of all these cards, that came out of nowhere in Gemini in the reverse. So this is a lower vibrational air sign on air sign crime. Okay. Or this person said you were low vibrational, Gemini, and they were trying to get to unalive you. That's what it was. And But you never gave up on yourself, or whatever the case may be. Yeah, this person has sick fantasies, or they, they have a lot of sick fantasies, you guys. This person is caught up in the justice system some kind of way. They're about to face jail time. They're scared right now because they could be facing, I don't know. I, I'm telling you, this person is bisexual. They say, I secretly like the same sex, and they hid this from you. They hid this from you. So if this person, I don't know, something about this, honey, okay, and now it's over. I don't know, child. I'm going to stay out of that one right there, okay? But Gemini, that's been your reading, child. You got, but and you moved away. So whatever the case may be, you're no longer with this person, and whoever the hitman see, maybe you moved away just in time, or you're not there, or something, baby. But somebody was watching you. They saw that it wasn't what it was, what this person hired them to do, and they ended up falling in love with you, and now they're trying to plot, plan, and strategize how to come towards you to make an offer towards you, and it's going to make you happy. It's the Ten of Cups, and this is a secret, and they're afraid to do so because they're going to expose somebody from your past about this murder plot. So how is Gemini High Vibe going to feel about it? That's what I want to know. How is Gemini High Vibe going to feel about it? You're going you're gonna to believe what they tell you with this Queen of Pen. Yeah. And for you, Princess of Cups, I feel, I, for some of y'all, y'all going to be flattered because of the, ball, the balls that it took for them to tell you and be honest with you. You know what I mean? Because that's a hard thing. That sounds crazy. Like, a hitman falling in love with the person they're supposed to unalive? How do you trust that person? You know what I mean? How do you trust that person? You're going to be guarded and defensive against this person because if they're friends or anything, so what is what is the outcome? What is the end? I, but I'm getting that this hitman wants to protect you and take you away, okay? Take you away. Yeah, and they want to marry you. They want to bring things to balance with you. I'm telling you, that's what love will do. It'll make the coldest motherfucker, okay? This person wants love. Instead of unaliving you, honey, they want to make you alive and give you a whole new life. Oh, my God. And they will protect you, too, now. I'm telling you. But I wouldn't cross this motherfucker because, honey, he look, he sound, he's, mm, his energy that I'm getting, you make him happy, too. And you already, child, you're going to be able to see right through this person. This person, they could be cold and detached at times, but you're going to bring that lover out of them. I'm hearing, this is for the lover in you. This is... I'll always be true. So this person going to always be true to you. Okay? They could be cold and detached, but you're going to be that sunshine. They see that warmth in you. And you can make this person so you can turn anybody. And this King of Swords energy, mm, honey, tell, oh, Lord, have mercy. They about to go to jail. Somebody about to go to jail, y'all. Well, I'm not going to draw this out any longer, but that's just the bottom line. So I hope this helps somebody. Okay? Until next time, I love you so much. And take care. Bye.